Hello guys, just look at this text highlight effect in Camtasia Studio where you can see a page zoom in and text gets highlighted. Then this yellow highlight effect gets faded out. So let's get to the video to see how we can create the similar effect in Camtasia Studio. First off, you need to go to import media and fetch in the snippet of newspaper or a page of book whose text you want to highlight. I have downloaded this page of an old book from the internet. Let me fetch in to my timeline. It's right over here. Hold it and bring it onto your timeline like this. Now you can stretch it or stretch out simply keeping in view how long you want the text highlight effect to be displayed. For me, I think this is enough. Now let's go to animations. Next, simply hold this cursor and bring into the point where you want your page to be zoomed in. Let me keep it right over here. Now you can simply grab this handle right from here and zoom it up like this and bring it to the point where you want your text to be highlighted. I think this is enough. Now you can see, let me show you, this is how your page would be zoomed in. Now after that, we want our text to be highlighted. For that, you need to go to annotations and in the basic style you can see we have this white colored rectangle simply hold it and bring it on the top of track 2 like this now hold this handle and decrease its size like this let me decrease it further and just get rid of the text inside it by selecting it and then pressing the delete key let me reduce its size further keep it onto the text that you want to be highlighted and drag it so that it cover the entire text it would appear like this let me show you again select it in the properties pane you can see we have this option right over here annotation properties this is the solid fill color let me click over it and change it to yellow color i think this look okay but you can see there is a border around this rectangle let's get rid of this border you can simply remove the border or outline right from here click over here choose the selector color from the image and click on this particular color and now your outline or border has the same color as that for the fill color now you won't see any border around it next we can go right over here and decrease the opacity so that we could see through the text and i think this is good enough now we can read it and that's it now again if you play you would see the effect like this we actually want it to be shown gradually for that simply select it go to transition and here you can see we have this slide right effect simply hold it and bring it onto this rectangle and leave it now let me show you how this would look like and there you can see how beautiful this looks to be let me show you once more you can see the page zooms in and the effects gets played and it gets out but not at the right time for that you can simply hold it right from here and bring it back a little bit uh, let me leave it over here let me show you and there you go now it looks perfect so that's it for today's guy i hope you have found this tutorial useful please give it a thumbs up and thanks for watching